Welcome back, little beans. Warning. The following ASMR is only aimed for beans who are in need for comfort and positive energy from a favorite anime character. There won't be any NSF W versions of this ASMR. This is for all ages and is appropriate for all. However, if you feel uncomfortable from videos like this, then click off. To the ones who are staying, go right ahead and get all cozy in your blinkies, pop in your headphones, snack on some chocolate robots, and enjoy this ASMR. Ugh, I'm so bored. Luca can't go out and play. Kaluto's, of course, attached to mom. Dad's too busy. Lumi, I don't want to deal with him. Well, maybe I should pick on Maluki. Maybe mess up with his hentai. <laughs> nah, he would whip me again. <sighs> I'll just do another trek around the forest. Or maybe just find intruders trying to break in the mansion. I'll do that instead. Uh, who in the hell is that? Is that an intruder? Can't be. Hey, what are you doing here? You're not supposed to be here, you know. Hold on. Who are you? Well, speaking from your outfit, you must be the new butler, right? Hey, hey, why are you backing away from me? I'm not gonna do anything bad. Oh, you can sense my aura, don't you? <laughs> yeah. The name's Kilua. Kilua Zoldic. Yeah, I am the Kilua. What, don't tell me you're a fan. <laughs> I'm just teasing, God. Don't have to get worked up about it. Anyway, so what is your name? Hmm, I'll call you Listener Coon. Hope you don't mind that. Dude, it's okay. You don't have to call me Masters, old dick. Just call me Kilua. Just only around me, because if it's around butlers or my family, you have to call me Master. But there's no one around here, so I don't mind you calling me Kilua. Yeah, I can see us like bros. At least I can, you know... Wait, you don't mind that we can hang out, right? Yeah? Well, when it comes to butlers, they have to watch us, so, uh... I'm just outside, just walking, doing a track. No one just doesn't want to hang out with me because... Isolation... You know, about assassins. Oh, and let me ask you this. Why are you here all alone? Oh, looking for intruders, huh? I was gonna do the same thing. How about we do it together, listener coon? All right, let's go for a nice walk. Once again, you can just call me Kilua. Why, do you think Illumi's gonna watch us? Don't worry, I don't really sense him anywhere. He could be out with his boyfriend, Hizuka. Creepy dude, though. Don't worry. If I know there's something wrong, I'll let you know. Anyway, let's go. You alright? <laughs> I don't know. You're, you're turning red. Is everything alright? Is it hot under that suit? <laughs> I'm just kidding. Sorry, I... You just don't get my jokes, do you? <laughs> Seems so easy. <laughs> Why are you backing away? Okay, come on, I'm nothing like my dad or my grandpa or my brothers. Look, I'm not gonna torture you or treat you like a toy. That's all I need, That's all I need is just a friend. What was that, listener? No, 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 no. I'm actually curious. What did you say? Huh? 
You think I'm cute? <laughs> okay. So? I mean, I'd say the same way. Well, the same thing, I mean. You don't look bad yourself. How old are you? Huh. You're only a year older than me. Well, that's fine. And I don't mind the height differences either. You seem kind of cool, listener coon. I bet we can get along really well. <laughs> well, I don't see any intruders anywhere. No, I don't sense them either, or hear them. Except for uh, little squirrels and some rabbits. But all in all, we're good. Hmm. Quick question, listener coon. Have you got to meet Mike? Well, you can call him the security or the house pet. Well, more like an outdoor dog. You want to meet him? Don't worry, he won't attack you. I mean, if you go through that door over there, yeah, you're fucked. <laughs> but don't worry, he's a really good boy. Let's see if I can call for him. Mike! Mike! Come here, boy! You just gotta give him a minute. Again, if you get scared, you can hold me. I don't mind if you hold on to me. I can, I can handle the beast. Oh, here he comes. <laughs> hey, boy. How's it going, you dangerous doggo? <laughs> oh, you're such a good boy. Yes, you are. <laughs> Come on, listener. Well, he, he's got to have your scent first, so go ahead. Hold out your hand. Don't worry, he's not going to hurt you. <laughs> Looks like he likes you already. Oh, you're such a good boy. <laughs> yeah, you can pet him. He likes it under the ears. Yeah, he's like a dog. To me, I still see him as a pup. <laughs> oh, good boy. Good boy, me gay. <laughs> yeah, listener? I mean... I used to ride uh, on his back when I was very little. It was like four or something. But then, you know, I don't know. I just don't want to hurt the old boy's back. <laughs> Again, just never take, you know, that door. Or if you want to be eaten. But as long as you're with me, you're alright. <laughs> Sometimes I like to sneak out just to... Go snuggle with him because he's really fluffy. He makes a better blanket. <laughs> you did good, listener coon. Yeah, <laughs> you finally got to meet the house's pet. I mean, if I, I if I only had something, I, I could reward you for doing a good job. Well, there is one, but I don't know. It seems a little inappropriate, but, uh, well, lean your face close. Yeah. N not, not too far, not too far. No, tilt your head to the side. Just turn your head. Oh my god, let me do it for you. See, I didn't snap your neck like that. <laughs> now close your eyes. <laughs> you can open them now. Yeah, I just kissed your cheek. T shut up! I was just trying to be nice to you, okay? It's not because I like you like you. Okay, yeah, I, I like you, but not like the second part, yeah. Sh shut up, Baka. Don't even... If you tell the butlers about this, or anyone, even my family, I don't know, I'm just gonna run away. 
huh? <laughs> and what are you gonna do about it if I run away? Hmm? Are you gonna punish me? Are you gonna chain me? Are you, I don't know, gonna beat me up? I'm sorry, what? You're just gonna put me in a timeout chair and watch me? <laughs> wow. <laughs> Never knew you had a soft spot for me, listener coon. Even though we just met, I guess that kiss changed everything how you see me. Hmm. <laughs> Actually, that doesn't sound too bad. How about we can try tonight to see if you can really do that? Huh? Oh, looks like it's dinner time for me. Well... Let's see if you can catch me tonight. See you later, listener coon. <laughs> Gotta teach this bad boy a lesson. <laughs> mm -hmm.